there's no light in here. Hi. It's 6.17 on Wednesday morning, Wednesday, January 2nd. A lot of people are restarting today. A lot. I think I have like five clients that are restarting today and um, going right along with them. So are they my clients? Nah. Not really. Am I a health coach right now? Not really. I'm concentrating on myself. And admittedly, I don't even know if I have to use the word admittedly, but people are ordering from my website. Um, they appreciate my videos and they know that I make commission off of the um, meal supplements. So um, I appreciate that. But I'm not considering myself to be a health coach right now. Um, I've had a couple people who have messaged me asking me questions and I answer the questions as much as I possibly can, but I usually, um, encourage people to, I'm just looking at a Christmas stocking. We already put our Christmas stuff away and now all, there's like two things that we didn't get into the box and the box is now in storage. So that pisses me off. Anyway, um, I encourage people to go look up the answers for themselves and not have me spoon feed them the answers. Because even as a health coach, I didn't do that. Um, it's really important for people to know why they're doing things and not just how to do things. There's a reason. There's a reason why our, you know, uh, the condiments that we use are, you know, limited. There's a reason why the ounces that we eat of certain um, vegetables and stuff like that is limited. Um, so... And also, you know, everybody's doing their plan differently. I, when someone says to me, if I'm being a health coach and somebody says to me, how do I do this? I give them the textbook. And then if they say, well, can I do this? And I say, you can do anything. You can drink coffee. You can drink vodka. You can add ketchup. You can do intermittent fasting. You can do anything that you want. But if you're asking me to be your health coach on this particular program, I'm going to tell you that they tell you to start off by the book this way, this way, this way. Okay. And then you could tweak it to however you want it to be. So now the program that I am doing says that I can have five ounces of beef. I'm not going to do that. I haven't eaten beef in two years, something like that. Pork, two years. I haven't eaten beef and pork. We, I stopped at the same time, although I was never a huge pork eater. Um, I haven't eaten beef or pork, so I consider those to be land animals in a little over two years, probably. I think in March it's going to be three years. And I stayed with poultry for a while. And I still don't think that I'm going to eat turkeys. I think I went into that in another video. Um... Because I have a little soft spot in my heart for turkeys, but I have started to eat a little bit of chicken. I eat chicken maybe twice a week, something like that. It's more about fish. Like last night I had salmon and asparagus. And the pee stinks. Like, instantly. Anyway. Um, so, this video is kind of all over the place. Um, I did weigh. And I am up again. Which is like... I could say it's really disappointing, but it doesn't surprise me at all. <laughs> um, but I now have 57 pounds to lose. And that seems kind of daunting. But if I take it one day at a time, that's all I have to do, right? One day at a time. So 57 pounds. Technically, it's 56. Yesterday morning, it was 57 pounds. Today, it's 56 pounds because I did lose a pound yesterday. So... That's where I am. That's what I want to do. I want to lose 56 pounds as of today. 57 as of yesterday. How much weight do you want to lose? And it's not only about the scale. It is about the scale right now because I'm not exercising yet. So, you know, once I start exercising and actually building muscle, then that balance changes and those goals change. Anyway, I'm going to keep it short and sweet. Vlog number, I don't remember. I'm going to switch up my, the titles of these vlogs now. And it's going to be, this is going to be day two. 
because it's January 2nd. I fell for it. I fell for all the hype of the calendar. But it really just has to do with the fact that, you know, at, at some point the holidays have to be over and the celebrations end and the productivity begins, right? So, um, this is vlog day two of my 57 pound journey. <laughs> Talk to you later.